find the one, you should never give her up. I think it's the way life changes when in love, yeah. Hey babes, welcome back to a brand new video. My name is Derry. If you see my face for the first time, we basically talk about fashion, travel, lifestyle, makeup, beauty, almost everything on my channel, guys. Today's video was inspired by an Instagram page that I recently started following. They basically talk about fashion, like they will ask you like, what's your fashion style? You know, what's your favorite fashion piece in your wardrobe? What are you really like loving right now, fashion wise? If your house was burning down, what's one fashion item that you want to leave the house with? Basically those kind of silly questions and i was just thinking actually i remember watching that video and i was like what is actually my favorite fashion piece because i don't know i have a couple of things that i really like um i feel like i can lose all of my clothes i really don't mind i don't really spend so much on designer clothes so my clothes is not my major problem if i lose all of my clothes and i have to go shopping afresh I feel like it wouldn't be the end of the world for me. Like, I'll be sad, I'll be like, oh my God, my size is so hard to get, things like that. But I feel like I'll get over it. But you see my bags and some of my shoes, like if I have to lose them, oh, I'll be so sad. Cause not because I feel like they don't sell them anymore, but just because I feel like they're so expensive. It's not things that I can just like buy basically so it just inspired this video and i'm just you know going to go through with you guys the fashion items in my wardrobe that i really love that i feel like i can't do without i love them i pair them almost every time they go so well with almost all of my outfits so that is why i love them i think number one on the list should be this bag this bag was a very good buy i was inspired to buy this actually by my friend she bought it first and i was like you know what that color is not bad because i've been seeing the nude one i actually wanted the nude one i was like i want the nude one but they were not doing new sales on the nude one the nude one was very hard to buy i think the nude one was so expensive and i remember them doing sales and i saw this one and i was like let's buy it and tell me why it has turned out to be one of my favorite pieces it suits and um, it basically just it goes well with a lot a lot a lot of outfits that i wear i wear because i wear black and white a lot those are my favorite colors black white neutral tones so imagine so it really really suits like my outfits and i'm such a gold girl so this is the first on my list. I really love this bag. I feel like it was such a good buy. And to think that I didn't buy it at the full retail price is even a bigger steal. I think my second fashion piece that I love is this transparent slippers. It's one of the most comfortable shoes that I own. It is so comfortable. Can you guys see how it looks? That's because I wear it all the time. If we're going out for a night out and I wear this shoe, it's over because I'm not going to be bougie. It's because I want to dance. It's because I want to have fun. You see these shoes? It's not them bougie shoes. But like, even when I wear it, it looks really good like because of the style. But like, if I wear it, it's over because I'm going to dance. I'm going to have fun. I'm going to enjoy myself. Like, that night is all over. And I think the third fashion piece that I recently just bought, but I am really loving is this slippers they're from primark it's like kitten eels um i don't like kitten eels i literally ate kitten eels but guys kitten eels are coming back and the reason they're coming back is because of the comfort obviously they're stylish you see the slippers guys since i bought it i haven't put it down it is so cute i've worn it for brunch i've worn it for dinner i've worn it to work like it is so classy i've wanted to go get groceries like I love it it's so comfortable it's unbelievably like beautiful like i feel like if you wear like a long nice dress and you just want to wear something just to elevate your look if you wear like a jean and a top you just want to wear something to like not look too casual it's such a good buy another fashion piece of mine that i really love has to be my fendi bag it's the knuckle bag this one since i bought it i haven't put it down like it's so bad the like, last two trips that i have planned i was physically told that please can you not bring this bag <laughs> like can you bring another bag like that is how much i like this bag it is so cute it is such a cute small bag like and me when i like stuff you know how i know that i like my fashion items once i like to once i start to keep it i keep the receipts i keep everything keep the box just know that she likes that fashion item so that is another fashion item of mine that i really like um i really like anything casual and simple so 
the Gucci Tonk slippers is definitely a high one on my list. You see these slippers, guys? It is my style. I love wearing slippers. I'm such a slippers girl. So, and I've had it before. So, I was like, you know what? Like, that's the thing about me. Like, once I like something, I don't even mind buying it over and over again. As long as it serves the purpose, it's classy, I like it. That's all that matters. That is all that matters, guys. Like, I don't care what the price is. I don't care. No, I care what the price is. What the hell are you trying? I care what the price is, but like, I'm just saying, like, if it's nice, if it suits me, I will just buy what I'm used to rather than like buying something different or like say, oh, I've had that before. I want to buy. Maybe if I want to buy the same thing and I don't want to buy the same thing, I'll change the color. But I wouldn't say, oh, I want to buy something different. Maybe blah, 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 blah. Another thing that I like, of course, is the MS um sandal i love it i love it so much this is my second buy for the slippers as well um i've had the brown one before now i have the black one i really love it it suits my look it's very classy i feel like if you wear like a nice jeans nice top nice bag and the ms slippers you're good to go like it's just it's just chic i think my favorite item in my wardrobe is it has to be this louboutin shoes it's so emotional because I have always wanted it. Like literally almost all my life, I've always wanted like red bottoms. I don't know what it is about the shoes. I think it's just like from watching movies, just seeing women like being very like classy and dressed, going to office, things like that. And you know, I've just always seen that like they wear like corporate shoes and the shoes have red bottoms and I just told myself like I want a red bottoms. I've always wanted it. I've wanted it so long. And yeah, finally I got red bottoms. I've tried to get red bottoms before and it's actually a funny story. It's a story for another for another day. I wanted red bottoms so bad that I got a red bottoms that was fake basically but I like it so much that I could tell that it wasn't the original one like that's how much I like the shoes because I went online like I read reviews I compared it to what I had in front of me and I was like this is not the shoes but anyways guys I've got red bottoms now and I'm so excited this is like my favorite shoe ever if I am going out with you and I wear this shoe hmm, I really like it let's just leave it there like because it is my special baby like i feel like i feel like i would never like not take care of those shoes like you know that fashion you know i feel like everyone has that fashion item that you really like like you really want it it's not even about the price it's not even about it's just emotion you're just emotionally attached to the shoes i feel like that is how i am with louboutins like I have wanted it for so long. It's like my dream girly shoe. If someone says like, what is your dream girly shoe? I feel like I will say Louis Vuittons. If I have a male friend today that says, oh, I want to buy a friend a gift for like my babe. I think I'll just tell him like, buy a Louis Vuittons. Does she have, I just feel like it's a very like classy gift or classy fashion item for a girl that, you know, any girl whether you're working whether you go out every night or like i just feel like it's such a luxurious feel to like cut shoes and you guys already know how cut shoes are cut shoes are very like fancy and classy it just brings up your look like you know when you wear like skirt shirt carry a nice bag and just wear like a very nice cut shoe like that is like already amazing so i feel like every lady needs a louboutin like yeah i feel like that another item in my wardrobe that i absolutely love you know when you buy some things and you're like oh my gosh i am so happy i bought this this is one of that and it's new balance sneakers guys if you wear the shoes you would understand what i'm telling you this is one of the most comfortable sneakers i have ever worn in my entire life when i wear the sneakers it literally always feels like there is no shoes on my leg like it feels like there are no shoes on my leg i promise you like when i wear the sneakers i literally feel naked in the feet like i can't in fact there's nowhere i cannot get to like it makes working so easy for me so this is one of my prized possessions it's not so expensive i think it was about 100 pounds i got this one 
but it is super comfortable so comfortable that it is one of my favorite fashion items just because it's so comfortable anyways i think my last fashion item that i really like is this bottle of perfume um it's mason francis cottagean and it's aqua vitae it is so good it smells really nice but every time i travel this is my scent the reason is because it's so classy it's so girly no it's not so girly actually because i smelt it on a man and that's what made me like it i feel like it's it's not like the random francis cottagean you know the red one that everyone wears everyone just sees that red one and they're like oh i'm using mason it's called john everyone just thinks of like the red one and the smell automatically like already like you already know what the smell is but this is different because it's not like the general smell that everyone knows and it's quite expensive so i would class it as one of my most precious fashion item i always use this perfume when i'm traveling when i want to make an entrance basically like i want to smell really good i'm going out with friends when i'm going anywhere nice once i'm dressed up nicely and i'm going somewhere nice i always use francis cordijan every time i'm on holiday i use francis cordijan but yeah this is like my saint for like bougie bougie so when i use this one and i'm i'm most likely wearing my louis vuitton shoes but actually one last thing has to be like my fashion accessories I am so into like earrings, bracelets, chains, as in, I don't know, I'm not so lucky with gold. Like I remember when I went to Tirana, I bought two bracelets, I bought like a gold chain. They were all caught, everything has caught. Like, so I just find myself like, and before, before then even, all the like gold that I have worn before or I've owned, I always end up like cutting it. I always lose it, do you get? So it was like, it, so that's why i'm just like you know what maybe gold is not my thing but i still like accessories so any accessory that is gold you see my fendi bracelet is my favorite one like, if you don't know me with these fendi earrings then you don't know me because i wear it all the time you see all these damn accessories my swarovski chain things like that i love accessories so i'm into accessories now i never used to be but like those are the things i feel like when you grow up as well or when you're growing you find yourself and find what you like essentially so i feel like now for me i'm so into like accessories i'm into like bags i'm into like air i'm into like you know um, I'm not into perfume, which is so weird. I still, I'm, I, I still don't get it. Like, you know, people having like 15 bottles of perfume, 20 bottles of perfume. I mean, if that's your jars, no judgment. But like, I just don't get it. Like, I don't. Like, if this one finishes, I'll buy a new one. Why do I need to like? But I think it also like boils down to like the kind of person that I am. I don't like if you come into my wardrobe space or come into like my property where I keep my things. Like if you come into like my closet, my wardrobe, you'll be surprised because it's always so compact, so small. So I think because of the kind of person I am, I I struggle with like making choices. Like it kind of gives me like a very hard time making choices of, you know, what do I do? What do I do? What do I have? What do I wear? So like I kind of like try to like reduce the number of items that I have. If I'm buying an item, best believe that i already know how i want to rock it like i've already like thought about it and i know that it will go with a lot of my looks so i don't really like to like have a lot of stuff so it might be the reason why i don't love to have like so many bottles of perfume but i mean no judgment if that's your thing i mean for me i think my thing is like i think my most prized fashion items will be my bags my bags are quite expensive um i don't buy bags just randomly um, i'm getting into shoes now i have my eyes on like two expensive shoes that i want to buy um i'm just looking for somewhere to go so i can wear them do you get like i'm just thinking should i buy it i don't have anywhere i'm going you know that vibe but, like i think i'm getting into shoes um so for outfits i don't mind um yeah so that's it so these are my my favorite like items in my wardrobe let me know what you guys think let me know what you guys have what's your favorite thing in your wardrobe just tell me what you like in your wardrobe um these are mine and i guess this is where we're going to close the video thank you guys so much for watching if you love my blonde bombshell hair and my makeup don't worry i got you because i filmed it so i don't know if the video is going to go up before this one or after but if you like it don't worry there's a tutorial coming through so just watch out for it but yeah this is where i'm going to end my video and guys obviously before i go just make sure you like the video 
make sure you give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it because it basically helps youtube a lot with them so if you love me please like the video okay and i'll see you guys another time i'll see you guys next week basically let me let you guys go thank you guys so much for watching and i hope you guys enjoyed coming into my wardrobe with me and just showing you like my little prize possessions that i really like um i hope you guys enjoyed the video bye bye